Well, good morning. Can you find me off for a sunrise meetup? Why not come with me? Well, good morning, and I'm off to go into Derwentwater for sunrise again. But this is because we're having a meet up there f from a Facebook group that I'm part of. The last meet up, which I also videoed, was down at Fleetwood and Cleveland, where we looked at the old shipwrecks and then the is it Mary's shell on the beach at Cleveland. So, but today. The meetup is at Crow Park, which is what 10 minutes walk from home. So that's where I'm on my way. I'm a little bit, uh, as usual, a little bit later than I <laughs> intended. Wanted to get there well before sunrise, and as you can see, the light is already starting to come up. But it's I'm not quite sure. I think it might be too clear today to to be getting um, a good colour but anyway oh we're just gone into a <laughs> just going through some trees so it suddenly got dark but anyway we'll go and meet up see what we can find and we'll see you a little bit later Right, well we've, we've met up in Crow Park but it was very busy, there was quite a lot of people all crowded round. So I've come, as you can see here, to Isthmus Bay and we've got very, very still water. Um, there was a little bit of colour in the cloud but it's in the sky but it's gone because there's no red clouds as you can see it's going to be a, a clear day. So I have taken, captured a couple of images i'm probably just going to mooch around and see if i can come up with with anything else um, i was quite surprised at the level of the water i thought it was a little bit higher from the gate at crow park and the jetter here might have been underwater but unfortunately it's not but yeah it's i think it's going to be a good day so i'll take a couple more images and i'll head back to crow park and then from there i think we're going to go to Friars Crag and it might be worth just going down to um, the Centennial Stones so yeah I mean the, the decent images we get from here I'll put up on the video after this and then we'll head maybe take a couple more and then we'll head back to Crow Park so we'll see you a little bit later
Right, well, we're working our way round to, to Friars Crag, but we've just stopped here by the just beyond the landing stages. I've been taking one or two handheld images, but um, it's difficult to show you now. Uh, the wind's got up a bit and it's very ripply, but a few minutes ago it was flat calm and the reflections in, in the lake are stunning. And we've got actually, uh, looking up, we've got some definition in the cloud now. So, yeah, we're going to carry on. I've taken um, one or two images, particularly of that, that boat that's in the, the centre there. So if there's any images along here that are any good of the reflections, etc., we'll put them up on the video, and then we're just going to work further around the lake. So, yeah, we'll see you a bit later. Right, well, we've made it round to the Centennial Stones and um, I'm really chuffed today because as you can see there the reflections of the stones in the lake are actually phenomenal. I've never, I've never seen it like this before so I'm really chuffed and it's just rounding off a great morning's photography so we've taken some images at different angles and whichever are best we'll put up on the video and then we'll see you a, a little bit later.
right well i hope you um, enjoyed the video and i'm on my way back home now the others are uh, going back to the cars and maybe going up to ashness bridge and talking about going to buttermere but i'm just heading home um, although i brought some lunch with me i'm going to eat it at home and and then i've got to get a video sorted uh, to go out tomorrow today is saturday and the last video you'll have seen hopefully is when i went up grousedale pike which i did on tuesday and i've got to get the video done to go out tomorrow on this hopefully if you watch it you'll see the following sunday so yeah it's been a great morning although we've just been to um i suppose in my local backyard just down to derwent water for the meet up the conditions have been quite good as i say i've been was really chuffed with the images i got and hopefully they'll come out all right got it the centennial stones with the reflections in the water there of the stones i've never i've never seen so many reflections on derwent water so yeah in sunrise yeah there was no real color so it could have been better but that was excellent so yeah so just to remind people if you did enjoy it please click the thumbs up if you like what i'm doing why not subscribe and please if there's anything any positive or negative comments please do comment because um, all comments are much appreciated so yeah i mean just thinking of the future i'm not quite sure where we're going next um, i think the idea will be to try and go somewhere where we'll get some really good images although the walk up grisdale pike which um is the video before this was very good um, as a walk goes we didn't really go any places to get particularly um, good images there wasn't good compositions hopefully the images on there are, are quite good but they're not not as good as say the images i got this morning so i don't know where we'll go i have been thinking it's a while since i've been to Westwater, but i don't know we'll have a we'll have a think and a see and we'll find somewhere to go so yeah i don't think there's anything to say and i'm ram just starting to ramble now so we'll um say bye for now and we'll see you on the next video